Hi everyone, thanks so much for coming to class. My name is Kathleen. We'll be doing an hour flow today, focusing on the hips, the legs, the hamstrings. As always, listen to your body, take what you need, leave what you don't. All classes are donation-based. Information on how to donate is listed just below the video. Any amount counts and it's very, very much appreciated. Thanks so much for joining me. We'll get started today on our backs, coming into bound angle pose. All the way down onto the earth. You can lie flat here or take bound angle. Bring your feet together, your knees fall open wide. Place one hand on your heart, one hand on your belly. Close your eyes if that feels okay. Take a breath in through your nose, feel your low belly rise, your mid belly, your chest, hold at the top. Exhale out through your mouth, sigh it out, chest fall, mid belly, low belly. A couple more like that, inhale through your nose, fill up. Out through your mouth, sigh it out, let it go. Last one, inhale. Exhale, close your lips, breathe in through your nose, out through your nose. these next few breaths to get present. Notice any physical sensations in your body. Notice any sounds you hear. Option to stay. When you're ready for movement, draw your hands to the outsides of your thighs. Press your legs together. Give yourself a squeeze. Sway a little side to side. Still breathing here. Happy baby pose. Grab for the outside edges of your feet, maybe your ankles or your calves. Ground your head, neck, and shoulders. Lengthen your tailbone to the earth. Option to sway side to side. Be gentle here, still warming up your hips. And release your grip, grab behind your thighs, rock and roll up to a tabletop position. Find all fours. Inhale, cow pose, drop your belly, slide your heart forward. Exhale, cat, round and curl. And we draw your core up and in. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Continue to move. Add in anything that feels good. Come to a neutral tabletop, send your right leg back, bend your knee, hug your heel in, big circles through your right hip crease. Keep your core pulling in. Switch direction. Inhale, lengthen your right leg. Exhale, tabletop. Other side, inhale, extend your left leg back, bend your knee, hug your heel in. Big circles. Really exaggerate this movement. Take up as much space as you can. Switch direction. Inhale, send your left leg back. Exhale, tabletop. Coming into a toe squat. Tuck your toes, sit back onto your heels. Bring your shoulders right over your hips. Now, if this becomes way too much, you can lean forward, take the pressure off. 
or place the block underneath your knees. Option to sit on a block as well in between your heels and your hips. Wherever you're at, allow yourself to get comfortable. Take some shoulder rolls up and back, forward and down. This one gets pretty intense, so stay with your breath. So good for your feet, it helps with balance. Rest your hands on your thighs. Unclench your jaw. Stay with me if you can. Let's go for four more breaths. Two more, you got it. Slowly lean forward into a tabletop, tap your toes on the earth, and then pick up the pace. Bring your knees to touch, your heels to touch, sit back onto your ankles. We'll take a counter stretch to the ankles. If this is enough, stay right here. If you want more, bring your fingertips back behind you. Start to lean back, peel your knees off of the earth any amount. Stretch the tops of your feet here. back to tabletop. Tuck your toes, downward facing dog, send your hips high. Inhale, shift forward, high plank. Exhale, back to down dog. Three more times like that. Inhale. Exhale. Two more on your own. This time hinge forward, high plank. Bring your shoulders forward towards your fingers. Maybe you tap your knees to the earth. Exhale, lower all the way down. Cobra pose. Inhale, lift your chest, pull your belly up. Exhale, lower. One more inhale, cobra with your core. Exhale to the earth, tuck your toes. Inhale, tabletop to your knees or reverse push up. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, ragdoll, walk your toes right behind your wrists. Bend your knees, hang heavy at your hips. Option to grab for opposite elbow creases, sway side to side. your grip go if you've got one. Inhale, halfway lift, flatten out your spine, belly pulls in. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Two more. This time you rise to stand. You can stand straight up or curl up one bone at a time. Send your arms to the ceiling at the top. Big breath in. Exhale, back bend. Cactus out your arms, lengthen your tailbone down. Inhale, rise. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high to low pulling. Take your push up or head to down dog. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Flowing breath to movement, simple sun A. We'll go three times through today. Inhale, look forward. Exhale to your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Hands to heart, exhale. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, back bend. Inhale, up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. 
Exhale, high to low plank. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, lift to your hand. Exhale to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, back bend. Inhale, stand tall. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, push up to down dog. You'll take that one more time through on your own. We need back and downward facing dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step or hop to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose, sit down, sit back. Find the depth in your chair. Rock your knees back towards your heels. Breath in and start to squat, breath out. Really working into the quads here. Pull your belly and that supports your low spine. Stay with your breath. Just notice any thoughts that creep in along with the challenge in your legs. Find stillness. Inhale. Exhale. Airplane arms. Draw your hands back. Flip your palms down. Really open through the heart. Option to come high into your toes here. And we'll pulse again. Can you sit a little lower? Maybe a little further back. Take a full round of breath. Drop your heels to the earth. Inhale, one-legged mountain. Rise to stand. You'll bring your left knee up towards your left hip. Flex your toes to the sky. Inhale. Exhale, figure four. Hook your left ankle on top of your right thigh. Sit down and back. So your left foot is at a 90-degree bend. Your left ankle bends to protect your knee joint. Think chair pose in your standing leg. You got a couple breaths here. Maybe you hinge forward, push your left elbow into your inner thigh. Now, if this is too much, take an eagle wrap with your left leg over your right or back to chair with both feet rooted in the earth. Two rounds of breath. Inhale, one-legged mountain. Use your core. Take your time. Find your point of focus. Exhale, warrior three. Hinge forward. Hands to your heart, to the earth, or maybe a block. Parallel your chest, your back leg to your mat. Take an inhale here. Exhale, squat, bend your right knee, bring your left knee behind your right calf. Inhale, lift with your core and your right leg. Exhale, squat. Two more to start off. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, lift. Exhale, squat. This time you lift, inhale. Exhale, standing splits, hands to your mat. Maybe you challenge your balance, grab for your ankle or your calf. Drop your gaze towards your shin. Take an inhale. Exhale, low lunge, bend your right knee, step your left toes back in space. Inhale, warrior two, open up to the left, widen your stance, see that your front heel meets the inside arch of your back foot. Gaze towards your front fingers, breath in. Exhale, extended side angle, right hand down, left hand high or forward. Option here to come onto your right toes, different sensation through your quads. Feel your heart open.
full round of breath. Maybe you keep your heel lifted. Inhale, reverse warrior, peaceful warrior. Reach up and back, finding the side bend. Notice your shoulders slide up towards your ears. Draw them down your spine. Full round of breath. Take an inhale. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse warrior. Right heel to the earth. Exhale, low lunge. Plant your hands to frame your front foot. At the same time, spin your back heel to the sky. Inhale, twist. Open your right arm up. Pull your belly in. Find this rotation from your mid to upper back. Hug your inner thighs together. Coming into standing splits, take a breath in to prepare. Exhale, back to standing splits. Right hand down, step onto your right leg. Lift your left leg high. Breath in. Breath out, breath in, exhale high to low planks. You can step back into your push-up or you can jump back, land with bent elbows. Inhale, up dog, exhale, down dog. If you're taking that jump back, bend your elbows, land in your low plank, that'll protect your joints. Putting that together on the left side. Inhale, look forward. Exhale to your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Find your deck. Find your solid base. And then you pulse. An inch down, an inch up. Maybe you wiggle your toes to see how, see how much weight you can get back into your heels. Take an inhale, exhale, airplane arms, draw your hands back. Option to come high into your heels if you did so on the other side. Find that pulse again. Bring your core in a little tighter. Find your gaze, something unmoving a few inches in front of the earth. Drop your heels down, breath in, breath out. Inhale, one-legged mountain, straighten your legs, lift your right knee in line with your right hip. Exhale, figure four, or whatever variation you're taking in your legs. Keep a 90-degree bend through your right ankle. Sit down and back. You should feel a nice stretch through the outside of your right hip. Two breaths. Take your time. Inhale, one-legged mountain. Right knee in line with your right hip. Exhale, warrior three. Letter T shape in your body. Keep a micro bend in your standing leg. Roll your right hip down in line with your left. Find your hand placement. Take a breath in. Exhale, squat. Bend your left knee. Tap your right knee behind your left calf. So it's backward rather than moving your knee towards your toes. Inhale, lift. Exhale, squat. Inhale. Exhale, you got one more. Take a breath in. Exhale, standing splits. Hands to your mat or your cap. Drop your gaze if you'd like. Keep both hip bones facing the earth. breath in, bend your left knee, exhale, low lunge, step your right foot back. Inhale, warrior two, open up, widen your stance, find your deep lunge, squeeze your shoulder blades together, really activate your upper body. Inhale here, exhale, extended side, angle left hand down, right hand high. If you did so on the other side, peel your front heel off of the earth, really push through the pinky toe edge of your back foot. Your legs, inhale, reverse warrior, peaceful warrior. Next 
Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, heel to the earth, hands to the earth. Spin your back, heel to the sky. Right away, pull your core in, inhale, twist. Open up to the left. If you need more space, pull on the outside edge of your left foot, open your left knee a little, and press your right hamstring to the sky. Take an inhale. Exhale, standing splits. Tap your left hand down. It's a lot of core work. Step on your left leg, and right leg comes to the sky. Again, inhale, exhale, step back, jump back, high to low plank or head to down dog. Inhale, up dog or cobra pose. Exhale, downward facing dog. Taking that breath to movement two times through, you always move at your own pace. Option to rest in child's pose or any stretch that feels good. Breath to prepare, inhale, exhale. Inhale, look forward, exhale, step or hop to the top. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose, exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, one-legged mountain, left leg high. Exhale, warrior three. Take an inhale, two squats, exhale, inhale, lift, exhale, squat, inhale, lift, exhale, standing splits, full breath in and out, and then in, exhale, low lunge, inhale, warrior two, exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse, peaceful warrior. Exhale, extend. Inhale, peaceful warrior. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, twist. Exhale, standing splits. Take a breath in. Exhale, high to low plank. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, one-legged right knee high. Exhale, warrior three. Breath in. Exhale, squat. Inhale, lift. Exhale, squat. Inhale, lift. Exhale, standing splits. Full round of breath. One more inhale. Bend your left knee. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, extend. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, twist. Exhale, standing splits. Breath in. Exhale, high to low plank. We meet in down dog. Inhale, up dog or cobra. Exhale, down dog. One more time through each side. We'll add in the figure four this time. Inhale, look forward. Exhale to your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair. Exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, one leg and left knee high. Figure four. Exhale. Stay for a breath in. Breath out. Inhale, one leg and take your time. Exhale, warrior three. Breath in. Exhale, squat. Inhale, lift. Exhale, squat. Let's do two more squats this round. Inhale. Inhale, lift. Exhale, squat. Inhale, lift. Standing splits. Exhale, full round of breath. 
Take an inhale. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, peaceful warrior. Exhale, extend. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, twist. Exhale, standing splits. Inhale. Exhale, high push up to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, look forward, left side. Exhale, step or hop to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, one-legged right knee high. Figure four, exhale. Breath in, breath out. Inhale, one-legged. Exhale, warrior three. Take an inhale. Or squats, exhale, squats. Inhale, rise. Exhale, squat. Inhale, lift. Two more on your own. Standing splits, exhale, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two, exhale, extended side angle, inhale, reverse, exhale, extend, inhale, reverse, exhale, low lunge, inhale, twist. Exhale, standing splits. Breath in. Exhale, step back, jump back. High plank, low plank. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Big breath in. Sigh it out, let it go. Lift your right leg high, inhale. Exhale, lizard lunge. Step your right foot to the top right edge of your mat. Both hands are inside your right foot. Then find a little movement here. Side to side, forward and back. Tap your left knee down if you wish. Use this as a recovery pose, a resting pose after that flow. You could drop down to your forearms or use your block if you're somewhere in between. Ship onto your hands, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee. Inhale, three-legged dog, kick your right leg back. Exhale, knee to right elbow, shift forward, find high plank, then tap your left knee down and keep it there. Or inhale, kick it back. Exhale, knee to nose, tuck your chin around your spine, inhale, kick. Exhale, opposite elbow. Inhale, kick, one more time. Exhale, right elbow. Inhale, kick. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, kick. Exhale, opposite elbow. Inhale, extend. Exhale, step through, low lunge. Inhale, kneeling crescent. Tap your left knee to the earth. Lift your chest, arms come up. If it feel good, feels good, hands to your front thigh, shift your hips forward and back. But if you want a chest expansion, interlace your hands behind your spine with your right hand on top of your left to start. Release your grip, inhale. Exhale, half split, straighten your front leg, fold over your front thigh. You know your body, so if you feel ready for full splits, go for it, but we haven't really stretched the quads yet, so really be mindful, be gentle here. 
Think length on your inhale, send the crown of your head forward. Depth on your exhale by bending your elbows. Keep your spine flat rather than rounding your upper back. Inhale, crawl forward, low lunge, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee. Warrior two, open up, straighten your front leg, triangle pose. Reach your right hand forward, push through both feet. Just a micro bend in your front knee. Create space first, maybe pause for a moment here. And then right hand down to your shin, your block. Left hand up, rotate your heart open. If there's a different variation in your arms you'd like, go for it. Breath in, breath out, inhale, come all the way up, toes out, heels in, exhale, horse squat. Draw your hands to heart center, sit low. Find your depth here, see that your knees and toes point in the same direction. Close your eyes, find your breath, and just find some movement that feels good. So maybe it's a squat, maybe it's a shift side to side. Maybe it's a hop jump here, or maybe it's stillness. Let's go for 10 breaths. It's gonna get pretty intense, right? If you keep your depth, but stay with your breath. I know you can do it. Six breaths, slow, controlled. Let your legs shake. Four breaths. Breath in, breath out, inhale, star pose, great work. Toes turn in, puff up your chest. Exhale, wide-legged fold, fold forward. Hands to the earth or your feet. Rock weight towards your toes, your hips over your ankles. Option to bend your knees if this bothers your low back. And then you know what you need, so if there's a different variation or an add-on here, Go for it. Send your arms out to a T or your low back. Bend your knees a little. Inhale, rise to stand. Warrior two to the front. Spin your front toes forward. Inhale, reverse, warrior. Exhale, high to low plank. Shift forward, find your plank pose. So we're gonna hold here for a minute, really working into the core. You can tack your knees down at any point or find child's pose. Maybe you take a different variation. If you want to work the upper body more, go for air push-ups. You can drop down to forearm plank, take some pressure off your wrists if that feels good. 30 seconds. Less than 20. Last five, four, three, two, one. Tap your knees down. We'll flow through a few cow cats. This time, if it feels okay, flip your fingers to your knees. So stretch out your wrists and your forearms. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Okay. 
find neutral, flip your fingertips forward, tuck your toes, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg high. Exhale, lizard lunge, step your left foot to the top left edge of your mat. Both hands are inside your left foot. Shift forward, back, side to side. And tap your right knee down. Again, use this as your resting pose. Find comfort here. Allow your heart rate to settle, your breath slow. Push up onto your palms, tuck your back toes, downward facing dog, send your left leg high. Take an inhale, exhale, knee to left elbow, shift forward, high plank, maybe you tap your right knee down, inhale, kick, exhale, knee to nose, inhale, kick, exhale, opposite elbow, Inhale, kick one more time through. Exhale, left elbow. Inhale, kick. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, opposite elbow. Inhale, kick. Exhale, step through, low lunge. Kneeling crescent, tap your right knee down. Take the same variation you did on the other side, so arms up your front thigh or chest expansion with your left thumb on top. Shift your hips down and forward and your tailbone to the earth. Really push your front foot into your mat. Release your grip, arms come up, inhale. Exhale, half split, straighten your front leg, fold over your thigh. You can bend your left knee as much as you need to. Let's go for two more breaths. Crawl forward, low lunge, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee. Warrior two, open up, coming into triangle pose, straighten your front leg. So left foot forward, straighten your left leg, reach, 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 and then left hand down, right hand high. Kind of similar expression here. Then gaze up towards your top hand, or if this ever bothers your Neck, try gazing towards the earth. Active through both feet, both legs. Breath in, breath out. Inhale, star pose, come all the way up, toes out, heels in. Exhale, horse squat, sit low, find your depth right where you left off on the other side. We're gonna take the same thing here. So 10 breaths, option for stillness. Maybe you come onto your toes. Maybe you're taking squats or straighten your legs whenever you need to. So 10 breaths, close your eyes. Option to place your hands on your heart. Feel your heart beating in your chest. Eight breaths. Halfway through. Press your knees back over your ankles. Can you sit a little lower? Big breath in and out. Inhale, star pose. Come all the way up. Turn your toes in. 
exhale fold forward so option to stay in your fold or come into the yin version of frog so you'll tap your knees down it's kind of like child's pose but instead of your big toes together your feet are out wide with your ankles at 90 degrees and your big toes rotating towards the earth shift your hips back towards your heels drop your chest any amount so if this is too much fine child's pose instead with your big toes together you can always support your chest here with a block or a pillow holding here for about a minute stretching into the inner hips close your eyes farther apart your knees the more of a stretch you'll feel and the closer your hips towards your heels the more of a stretch you'll feel you can also drop your chest closer to the earth four breaths Slowly push up on your hands. Take your time here. Here, slide your big toes together. Walk one knee in, send the other knee. Send one leg back, shake it out. The other leg back, shake it out. And then we'll meet in our wide-legged fold. Hips to the sky, toes turn in. Send your arms out wide or to your low back. Rise with the support of your core. Warrior two to the front, your left foot is forward. Inhale, reverse, warrior. Exhale, high to low plank. Push up or down dog. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, shift forward, high plank pose. So second set for your core here, you've got 60 seconds. Tap your knees down at any point or find child's pose if you need a rest, especially if you feel this in your low back. Really pull your core in, push your mat away. Find whatever variation, whatever movement feels good. Halfway through, 30 more seconds. Last 20. Ten seconds. Stay with me. Five, four, three, two, one. Tap your knees down this time, child's pose. Send your knees wide, big toes to touch. Sit back onto your heels. Rest your forehead. Option to stay or find down the dog. Inhale, lift your right leg high. Exhale, step through low lunge. Inhale, warrior one, ground your back heel. Shorten your stance. Use your core to lift your chest. Arms come up. Chest expansion and release your hands behind you. Right thumb on top. Feel your heart open. Really drive your back heel into the earth. You might even feel a stretch through your back calf. Release your grip, arms come up, straighten your front leg. Exhale, fold forward, pyramid pose. Straighten or shorten your stance if your back heel lifts. You can bend your right knee. If you want more, flex your right toes towards the sky. Try sliding a block 
underneath the ball mount of your right foot. It's pretty intense, so you can set it aside at any point. Two breaths. Standing splits, bend your right knee a little, step onto your right leg. Option for handstand hops this time or anything that would feel good. Drop your gaze, challenge your balance. Maybe pulse through your left glute, really feeling your hamstring turn on and your core pull in. Inhale here, exhale forward fold. Feet together or hip bones distance apart. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose, sit low. Find your depth. Eagle. Your right foot is your base. Lift your left leg up and over your right thigh. Your toes can touch the earth or your block or find your bind. Keep your hips facing forward, your knees at center. And then from here, hands to heart. Sit down and back. Find the depth in your eagle legs. And then inhale, draw your arms out, cactus out your arms to 90 degrees. Squeeze your shoulder blades together behind you. Create your own resistance here. Inhale, palms together, forearms together. Exhale, open out wide. Two more, sit low, inhale. Exhale, expand, shoulder blades squeeze. Inhale, exhale, open. Back to center. Slowly unwind your legs, find your chair. You're here for four, maybe pulse. Three, two, one, breath in. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plank to down dog. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, lift your left leg high. Exhale, step through, low lunge. Inhale, warrior one, shorten your stance, ground your back heel. Inhale, lift with your core so your spine is supported. Bend into your front knee, maybe widen your stance, especially if that bothers your back knee. Chest expansion, hands behind you, cross your left thumb on top. Dig your back heel into the earth. And lift your chest, arms come up, straighten your front leg, take a breath in. Exhale, pyramid pose, fold forward over your front thigh, shorten your stance if your back heel lifts. Find a similar variation on this leg. Two breaths. Coming into standing split, shift more weight forward, bend your front knee, step onto your left leg. Handstand hops or pulses through your glute. Drop your gaze. Breath in, exhale, forward fold, feet together, hip bones distance. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose, sit low. Eagle, this time your left foot is your base. Lift your right leg up and over. Draw your knees to center, your hip bones face forward. Sit low, squeeze your thighs together. Keep the depth in your legs. Bring your forearms, palms to touch. Exhale out, squeeze your shoulder blades back. Inhale to come in, pull your belly to your spine. Open up, draw it together. Two more. Slowly unwind your legs. 
legs, find the depth in your chair, you pulse four, three, two, one, inhale, exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift, exhale, push up to down dog. Inhale, shift forward to your plank, shoulders towards your fingertips. You lower to the earth for four. I will squeeze in three, core is tight, two, and one. Shoulder stretch, send your right arm out, palm face down, or 90 degree bend if you know you want more. Roll onto your right side. Should feel this through your right shoulder, the right side of your chest. to center, other side, left arm out, palm face down. center. Come up to your forearms. We'll take a quad stretch from down on the mat. Bend your right knee. Maybe this is enough. If you want more, reach back with your right hand. Grab for your foot. Hug your heel towards your glute. And then push your entire right thigh down. Stay active through your upper body. Push your left forearm into your mat. Roll your shoulders down away from your ears. Slowly release, other side. Bend your left knee, option to stay or go for the bind. Grab for your foot, hug your heel in. Really find the activation as you push your left thigh, your hip bone down to the earth. Press yourself up to a seat. We'll come into full pigeon or fire log. It's a pretty intense version of pigeon. So you can always come onto your back for supine pigeon or take traditional half pigeon. If you're taking full pigeon, bring your left shin in line with the top of your mat. Take your right ankle, bring it up and over your left thigh. You'll know right away if this is not for you, if it's too much. Cross at your shins, you can fold forward from there. If it feels okay, even out your weight through your hips, so you're firmly grounded into the earth, find the 90 degree bend in both ankles. Option to stay upright, option to fold forward. If you have a big gap between your top knee and your bottom ankle, use a prop in between. This bothers your bottom knee, give it some support with a block or a blanket. Find your breath. One can be pretty intense. Let's go for four more breaths. Last one. Slowly press yourself up. Unwind your legs, plant your feet on the earth. Drop your knees side to side. And then we'll switch out our legs. This time your right shin is on the bottom. Bring your left ankle up and over. Even out your weight, if that's too much, cross at your shins and fold forward from there. Find any support you need. Option to stay upright if you want to add on, crawl forward any amount, no need to force it.
four breaths. Gently curl yourself up, unwind your legs, plant your feet, drop your shins side to side. Send your legs out long in front of you, option to sit on a block, find your firm base, sit up tall, send your arms to the sky, inhale, exhale, seated forward fold. up and crawl all the way down onto the earth. Draw your knees into your chest, give yourself a squeeze, inhale. Exhale, supine twist to the left, drop both knees over to the left, stack your hips one on top of the other. Option to stay if you want more, kick your bottom leg out straight to the top of your mat. See how that feels. And then if you want to stay with the hamstring opening, you can straighten your right leg grab for your toes or your ankle with your left hand. Inhale, center, hug your knees in. Exhale, twist to the right, drop your knees to the right, stack your hips, and find a variation that feels good. Inhale to center, hug your knees in, give yourself a squeeze, exhale, release, final resting pose, get comfortable, find your resting shape, once you're there, inhale, big breath out, exhale, Please stay resting for as long as you can. Thank you so much for practicing with me.